What's up guys, Sam and back with another Pennywise review. Today we are taking a look at the brand new Iron Studios Pennywise the Clown. This is called Minico. These are little collectible vinyl figures. If you guys don't know anything about Iron Studios, they make a lot of great collectible statues. I've done several reviews on some of their statues. Uh, this one here is part of their mini code. They, they have several characters done in this form as well. A lot of DC stuff. I think they, I'm not sure if they've done Marvel stuff, but I did pick this up from BigBadToyStore.com. If you guys want to pick up this, pick this up or check out Big Bad Toy Store, make sure you guys use my link in the description down below. Now, okay, so you got the big box here open window that reveals Pennywise. Um, this guy is only priced at $29.99, so it's not a bad price at all. And then you have the mini coat right there. It says horror on the bottom. You come to the side, you got the open window as well. On the back, it says uh, ref, ref, reference, I'm assuming, MF06 Pennywise horror created by Iron Studios. They got their social media right there at the bottom. This is something I really like on the side is the artwork that they did for this. I think this is just really, really killer. They have some really, really cool artwork here and this is something I'm gonna be cutting from the box and displaying it somewhere in the It Shrine because I absolutely love the artwork. Um, on the top right there, you also have Pennywise on the box. So very, very cool. Let's go ahead and take Pennywise out of the box and let's see if he's a pickup or a pass. All right guys, so here we have Pennywise outside of the box. So first things first, we'll take a look at the base. He's got the circular base right there. You can see it does read it Pennywise. And then you can see the base has a little bit of texturing on it. I do like that. You can see it also on the top with the light on it, it looks really cool. But other than that, that's about it. He, you can't remove him from the base, he's glued on. Uh, the bottom has a little bit of information there by who it's created by, by Iron Studios, and I almost dropped the camera. <laughs> um, we'll start from the bottom, so we'll look at the, the shoes. Look at the sculpting on that. The shoes, the paint apps look great. I really like how they did his, uh, his shoes. And you can see the shoelaces, the little pom-poms, but I do like the coloring on them. And then you have the lower part of the leg, so you can see the design on the outfit. Again, the paint apps on this are very, very well done. It's a little darker as far as the movie goes. The paint apps on this are a little bit uh, on the darker side. He is holding on to Georgie's boat. Now it doesn't read SS Georgie, but it's obviously Georgie's boat. And then we come to the side and you can see the detailing on the arms. Now it's not like 100% movie accurate as far as the outfit goes, but you know, Iron Studios did their thing. And then you have the front here. You can see the pom-poms little ruffles right there for the top of the outfit and he is holding on to the balloon now I don't know if a lot of you guys will be nitpicky on how he's holding the balloon because when you see Pennywise holding the balloon he kind of tends to hold it like this and this one's not doing it he's holding it onto it like that so I don't know if that's gonna bug people about you know for that reason and then you have the red balloon right here it's just a red balloon um, this guy does not have any kind of articulation so it's almost like a little mini statue you can't rotate the head or anything the head sculpt is also a little bit different it kind of looks very animated, like a very animated uh, version of Pennywise. The the red, the paint where it's supposed to be red almost looks burgundy. It's like a really, really dark, dark red. It almost looks black on the view on the viewfinder. Um, they did make the eyes yellow, and you can kind of see the cracks on the forehead. Uh, you have to, and the, I don't know if you can see them on the viewfinder to be honest with you, but looking at it in person, you can kind of see them. They're very, very small, uh, but I do like the head sculpt, again, it's a very different look for Pennywise. And then you have the hair. So the hair looks a little bit more stylized. So this one looks like they kind of actually, you know, Pennywise actually did his hair in the morning, put some kind of like a gel or something on there. But it's not a bad little piece for the price point for it being, you know, a $29 piece. Um, I think, honestly, I mean, it's Iron Studios. You know, some of their stuff is in the price as, as, as their statues go. They go for about 100 and up. For their statues uh honestly i think this probably should have gone for maybe 19.99 if anything because it is just a vinyl figure and it's pennywise you know just you know on the base there's nothing too crazy about it but i still think um the price point might be a little bit too high for this figure so i'll give you guys a little bit of a comparison uh let's see if i have a funko pop next to me to show you a size comparison so we have a funko pop here uh the stephen king funko pop so you can see these he is a little bit taller and then i just reviewed these but i do have the cost babies it chapter two and you can see they're almost about the same height and that's because that's due to pennywise's hair but you can kind of see the scale for this guy here um you guys in the comments below 
let me know is this a pickup is it a pass and if you own any of iron studios little vinyl figures let me know which one you have because like i said they, they they're doing some dc stuff they're other, doing other characters too i just don't know on the top of my head I, I do know they have a lot of dc characters like this um you guys know i'm a big pennywise fan so this is something i had to add to the collection to put in the shrine let me know your thoughts on this is it a pickup is it a pass if you guys want to check out anything from big bad toy store make sure you guys use my link in the description down below Thank you for watching, guys. Gonna add him into the shrine right now. I gotta figure out where to put him. I have so much Pennywise stuff. Thank you for watching. Thumbs up the video. We'll see you soon. Later, guys. Awesome. Let's see. Bill's gonna.